We are back on Auto Show TV and we're excited to be back at Majestic Honda in Lincoln with Casey Martin. The all new 2015 CRV Touring is out. You have one here. There's been a lot of buzz and with good reason. Tell us all about the, the new Touring model. Absolutely. This is the first time Honda's had a Touring model in the CRV lineup. It's Honda for 2015 added a lot of the, the technological features that are available in other models to the CRV this year, but on the Touring model, they've gone above and beyond and even added two safety features that were never available on any Honda previously. It seems like safety was a big part of what was behind Honda in creating this. Absolutely, and two of the new features that I find just absolutely amazing, they, they have lane departure warning, we've gone over that before in other models of the Honda, but this one actually has what they call a lane keeping assist system. Not only does it monitor the lines in the road, but if it si finds that you're swerving in between, it'll automatically adjust and keep you in the middle of the lane. Amazing technology. It is. The next one they've added is the adaptive cruise control, which is available on the Accord Touring. They've expanded on that and added a collision mitigation braking system. It uses the radar of the adaptive cruise control to measure the distance of the car in front of you. And if it feels you're closing too fast because of a possible collision, it'll automatically apply the brakes for you. Casey, if there is a crash, uh, can you just talk a little bit about how the CRV reacts in terms of you know keeping the integrity of the passenger compartment because that's really Absolutely. the key that the vehicle gets damaged that's one thing but we got to protect the occupants and that's what honda's been you know, working on for years and years and the advanced compatibility engineering system or ace body structure this is the newest generation of it and what honda's really worked on is the most common frontal accident which is the partial or offset frontal collision. Yep. It's very rare that a car is hit dead in the middle. Yep. Uh, most of the time people try to avoid the accident and you just catch the corner of the vehicle. And when you think about how much energy is absorbed in one section, it's been so difficult for engineers to design a frame system that can absorb that energy and protect the occupants. And Honda has really done that with this newest ACE body structure. Yeah. What else would you like to show us about the Touring? Well, what I really like about, not only does it have the new technology, but the adaptive cruise control, you've always been able to notice it through the grill on the Touring Accord or other makes and models. Right. If you look at the front of the car, you can't see the radar. And Honda was clever enough to actually hide it behind the H. So it's right here? Yes, it is. Oh, for crying. Yeah, so from the front, you can't even tell it's there, but no. that's where the radar beams are sent for the adaptive cruise control and for the collision mitigation system. Nice. Also, as you can tell up here, that is for the lane watch. Right. So that is what's watching the lane in front of you to keep you in the lane or to, of course, warn you if you depart from it. Besides the safety features, let me show you the wheels on the Touring model. Sure. First time Honda's had an 18-inch alloy wheel. It's obviously a very attractive wheel. Stands out from the rest of the CRV it does. Lineup. On the Touring model as well, they've added the directionals in the side view mirrors, which is another great safety feature so that the other sure. vehicles on the road can see that you're trying to turn. Yep, folding mirrors. And they do fold, absolutely, yep. yep. Um, next feature is Honda finally added the Smart Entry System to the CIV lineup, and it's in the Touring model as well. Uh, very nice feature. The key never has to be removed from your pocket to open the door, to lock the door. Uh, so it's a very, very nice feature. In the back of the vehicle, first time in a CRV. People have been asking for this feature. A full power lift gate. Ta-da! Ta-da! <laughs> and it's, it didn't uh, have that before. Never been available. Um, Honda finally decided to add it when they designed the Touring model. They wanted to add all the new technology. Um, and it's a great feature, especially for people who are maybe on the little and the shorter side, um, because you can either hit the button on the tailgate to close it, or of course the remote control, just hold it down, and it'll close it by itself. So it's definitely a very popular feature people have been asking for in the CRV, and now it's available. Casey, there's the, the lane watch camera. Yep, right? that's the lane watch camera, which again, as we discussed, uh, when you put your right directional on, the camera will come on here so you can see your blind spot. So not only are you alerting the driver that you're turning with the directional uh, in the mirror, but you can actually see if a car is there. And this is the first CRV with a CVT transmission, correct? How it about is. that? It is, absolutely. And uh, CVT is the most common transmission uh, in almost a lot of vehicles now. Honda's had it in their Civic, the Accord, the Fit, and now in the CRV. What does that mean for those who don't know? It means constantly variable transmission. Uh, essentially, if you look at a five speed transmission, you have only five different gear ratios the car is allowed to use. With the CVT, it's constantly variable. So the advantage is if you want to accelerate quickly, the harder you push the gas pedal, the motor will rev and the transmission will adjust based on the RPMs of the vehicle. 
as soon as you let off the gas, the transmission speed will also adjust immediately, which yeah. means is when you need the power, it's there, and when you don't, you get the fuel economy. So you get fuel economy and performance. Absolutely. That's a beautiful thing. What are we talking mileage-wise, gas mileage? You get a few mile per gallon bump this year over the 14, so the average city highway is around 28 miles per gallon, which is amazing yeah. in a vehicle this yeah. size with all-wheel drive. I took a peek at the sticker, and 33 highway is very good. It's excellent. Yeah. So how's your inventory of the, the new 15 CRVs? So far it's great. We have a lot of uh, 15 models available in stock today. The Touring model might be a little hard to come by for a while because it's been extremely popular. Um, we've sold quite a few so far and we have a couple of them pre-sold as well. I can see why. It's absolutely. It's a great vehicle, a lot of technology, a lot of safety features and people are really excited about it. All right. Folks, get to Majestic Honda, two locations, West Warwick on Route 2 and right here on Route 146 in Lincoln.